gold yesterday has seen a good fall it has gone close to 2002 levels now what to expect from gold today can we expect it to bounce back or there is further crash awaited what is going to be our strategy trading gold today we will see with the help of charts and indicators this is the first update for the day next update will be released before the us session do not miss that thus if you're not subscribed to the channel subscribe to the channel to get the latest updates let's start first we'll start with the early charts and towards the end of this update i'll give you the trading levels and strategy watch this and yes if you have not joined the channel membership join the channel memberships to enjoy additional benefits now look at gold on the early charts first the resistance for gold on the upside at 2030 2032 is very strong and thus only rise only bullishness in gold is if it stays above 2030 32 zone till that time we should not trade gold as bullish it is just a retracement that is the first observation second observation after dropping sharply here it is trading in this retracement channel prices are little divergent from the 20 period there is possibility for it to converge towards the 20 period right now sitting at around 2030 2013 20, 2014 zone 2014 indeed is a greater resistance zone 2014 15 which was the support earlier is now going to act as a resistance that is the second point here third point uh yes it is trying to show reversal here and see after the drop retracement and again looking upwards a possibility for it to break beyond 2014 15 exist but still as i said the reversal levels are too far for the day that is above 20 30 32 levels moving averages here are trading with divergence and bearishness stock i stick is looking downwards see macd has crossed over here at the bottom trying to trade with divergence possibility for it to retrace a little on the upside exists strong rsi rising coming to two hour charts on the two hour charts see it is trading in this extending bearish triangle or increasingly bearish triangle if you look at the sharper fall here this calls for it to recover a little but re just see these three candles 2012 levels giving it a good resistance thus yes 2012 2015 zone i will say is going to remain the resistance for the day then i will see 2018 22 2020 see it has struggled a lot towards 2018 2020 zone uh, and thus we have to watch out again at those levels also on the two hour charts what has happened see a sharper drop and it is showing signs of a reversal here first candle then it is trading with higher lows higher highs if you look at a stock stick, this is also rising the magd has shown a stronger bearish momentum it has breezed the lows it has come to minus 10 level see while it was rising it is not even shown intent to break past plus five now a crossover here can make it come closer towards the neutral zone does it say, suggest that a crossover should lead to a little bullishness or suggest a little bullishness rsi is still near to oversold levels coming to three hour. on the three hour charts a reversal sign here prices fail to stay bearish look at the candle where we can see very small body and it is coming at the end of a downtrend suggests that the prices are trying to reverse since then we have seen it trading with slight bullishness also lower highs which means it has to break past by this zone that is 2012 2014 15 in order to confirm further rise or net reversal now remember about 2015 20 2012 zone you can expect 2020 2018 as the first resistance that is going to play a major role then 2024 25 and then only and only if gold is seen trading about 20 30 32 we can say that the prices are reversing see moving averages are trading with divergence certainly a bearish sign for gold here it has crossed over and since then traded with divergence and bearishness the stock i stick was oversold trying to come out of the oversold zone here while macd is still trading bearish it is trading with sharp divergence here we have to wait for it to cross over couple of bullish candles here will make it converge and then additional candles will make it cross over and make it bring it to the path of recovery else it is still trading bearish looking downwards rsi oversold coming to four hour chart on the four hour chart see the swings here a sharper swing candle then a reversal then a swing now this swing you should note it has created higher lows higher highs this suggests that it is trying to recover a bit more and possibility for it to rise exist but these two candles having a double top at 2012 suggests that it has to break past by this zone first 2012 and then 
2015. If these two are taken, we can look over to 2018, 2020 zone as the first resistance, then 2024, 25 the next. And only, only, only reversal confirmation is about 2032. 30 zone it has to break past by this zone moving averages trading with divergence trading bearish looking downwards a stochastic oversold MACD divergent and bearish it is trading with very good divergence possibility for it to converge and show couple of bullish candles suggest rsi oversold coming to daily charts and before we look into daily charts and sh i share the trading levels and strategy for the day if you want to learn this art of trading be a part of my 28th match batch commencing on 28th of january register yourself now reach out to me for more details my telegram and email ids are mentioned in the channel and video description also you can be part of my signals channel on telegram reach out to me for more details and yes if you're not joined the webinar series yet do not miss to join this it comes with two free consultations where you can discuss anything and everything and get a guidance upon and yes, you can visit the platform www.forexhonda.com for details, for answers to all your queries. And also you can write down an email or telegram to me. Do visit the pl platform forexhonda.com and for more live updates, join the free telegram channel. All the links are shared in the channel and video description. Now look at the daily charts for gold. You can observe here. See, let's track from the middle of October. Almost since last two to three months, gold has been trading in this channel here there was a breakout it has come down to the support this is the third rise it has come down to the support so can we say that yes the bottom here is done i will wait for a breakout below 2097 uh, zone yes if it breaks below 2000 and below 1997 is where one can confirm that the bears will take over here where i will look forward to 1980 as the next target as you can look at very easily that it has been trading in this formation here where it is hitting the highs and lows of the channel thus a recovery from here can lead to extremely stronger rise we have to be careful we have to be watchful yes 2000 is the level on the downside we should be watchful of below which you certainly more bearishness is going to prevail here uh 201997 these two levels you should definitely watch out for stochastic looking down hitting the bottom magdi is divergent magdi is bearish it has seen a good fall here and also one must remember see after the rise here it is showing this fall or retracement see the rise was vertical the retracement is gradual and hence a crossover here can lead to stronger bullish momentum it will definitely take a little time. RSI looking downwards, trying to trade bearish. Considering this for the, I will recommend you to buy at 2012-2015 zone and expect it to move towards 2018-2020, the first resistance, the first targets. If it breaks beyond 2020, we can look forward to 24-25 at the next. And if it stays above 30-32, that is the point where we can say gold has reversed. On the downside, only selling entry today is below 2004, below which you can expect it to hit 2000-1997 zone. And below 1997 is where the bears will take over. Take your positions accordingly. Like, share, subscribe and comment. Join my mentorship batch, webinar series, signals channel. And get the live updates by joining the free telegram channel or the platform www.forexwonder.com. Thank you very much. Have a great profitable trading day. See you again before this US session with latest updates. Thank you.